Hi guys, my name is Alina and I represent the brand Acera Vegano. We're basically made of all sustainable stuff. Our collection is made in New York City, everything is handmade. And today is our launch event. We're gonna, we're gonna launch our collection. So we're super happy to be here and we're super happy that you're listening to us. Can you talk a little bit about you? Well, what? Can you talk a little bit about you as Alina as a person? Right. So I'm a marketing manager for Sarah Vegano and also I am an influencer and a marketing representative. So my social media, my Instagram is Alwina underscore official with double F and the brand's uh, Instagram name is Esere uh, underscore vegano. So please follow us on social media. Uh, can you talk a little bit about your connections to the industry? Obviously, you and I, we know each other from the past, right? Uh, you also, I saw many videos with you and Raphael, you, you friends with Raphael. Right. Who are in your space the biggest influencers, people you work with, or the your brand relies on? Who are the people you would call to advance you? Uh, so, подожди, ты говоришь про меня лично или про бренд? Тебя, скажем, у тебя всех, у тебя есть, скажем, друзья, которые за тобой стоят, которые помогают тебе. И ты уже имена назвала? Имена, бренды, может быть, те, те, кто скажет хорошо о тебе. Есть такие вот, которые любят этот бренд. Есть, скажем, есть celebrity, которые одевают этот бренд. Есть мы пока такие... еще не дошли до этого, мы только его лаунчиваем. Ну, сейчас, ну, я сейчас, 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 кто сейчас кто я, кто я поддерживает да, 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 сейчас, секунду. Сейчас, дай подумаю. Может быть, фотограф хороший, да. как Рафаэл. Давай я сейчас а? назову пару имен. Может, твое тоже хочешь? Назову. Alright. Можно? Cool. Alright, so basically we have some people who are uh, in our brand, into it, and we appreciate that they are. One of our, our influencer is, um, her name is Olga Ferreira. So follow her on Instagram too. Then we have a great videographer. His name is Alexander Burman. And we have Thank also an, an amazing photographer. His name is Rafael Marin. So there are our supporters. Also, I would like to talk a, a little bit about our uh, audience. So basically we are people who are doing this, you know, this vegan organic brand. So basically we want to be on the highest level very soon. Also, and uh, very welcome to our online shop. It's the, the name is www.servegano.com. We have a lot of beautiful fashion brands, um, you know, coats, jackets, uh, dresses, whatever you need for be beautiful and vegan. This is so important nowadays to be sustainable. Thank you. Uh, next question. Let's talk about the advantage of being from Kazakhstan and speak Russian in the fashion industry. Obviously, uh, the girls who come from the Middle East and they have a little bit Eastern look, but uh, they also have European kind of feel, right? Very popular to add, to add to the fashion show. What is the advantage of coming from that part of the world? Because the Russian girls are known for their style and uh, fashion taste. Uh, what, what's the distinction in, in that space? All right. So basically, uh, I was born in Georgia, which was part of uh, USSR. Right, from part of USSR, and very proud about it. <laughs> I used to live in Europe for 15 years, in Germany particularly, and now I'm here in New York City and I'm super happy about that too. So basically, I feel myself very established in the brand like a model and uh, also I'm doing influencer stuff a lot, so I communicate and uh, collaborate with a lot of companies, hotels, brands, car brands, etc. So basically, I feel that the four years that I spent here in New York City, I'm only on, or, like already on the way to be bigger in the future, hopefully. Okay, let's look at this from the family perspective. I know your mother, uh, you have a family. A lot of uh, folks uh, look at the fashion just for young kids and sometimes it's actually people with it. Like I have a couple of kids, you have a uh, child. How the family connections, because the baby needs new shoes, right? Every day you need to buy and exactly. uh, produce. How that affects the fashion uh, in your mind? So, yeah, so already as you said, I have a two years old kid and that's crazy because I'm buying for him like, I don't know, every month, every two months I buy for him shoes and clothes because yeah, yeah they're growing very fast. 
So basically it affects a lot because uh, this is one of the main fashion industries like for babies, for kids, because like, you know, they grow and when they grow, you, you don't know what to do with that. So that's why sustainable fashion from a set of Vegano, we're also coming to have a baby collection in the future. It's very important nowadays. Excellent. Any closing argument? Anything you want to leave the audience to thinking about? Say when they go home tonight from the show, they see the show, how do you, do you want them to go? Do you want them to go inspired, or happy, or sad, like, ooh, like uh, feeling about uh, pandemic, or actually forgetting right. about pandemic? Like, what's the message? Honestly, I'm super happy that it's getting better. The Corona, the COVID thing was uh, the horrible thing for the whole world, and I'm happy that in the United States we're opening up. That's why I'm super happy also that we could have the opportunity to create this amazing event today. Super, super happy that you all were here. Thank you so much that you found the time and this like hard time, I would say, right? So that's why be inspired from our event. Uh, be happy for sure and be sustainable. Thank you. Um, 